In today's video, I'm going to be walking you through the step-by-step -step guide on how to get music from a CD onto your smartphone. Now, to do this, you need to take whatever CD that you're interested in listening to on your smartphone and go over to your computer and put it into the CD drive. Now, a lot of computers don't have CD drives, so if that's the case for you, it's going to be a tough situation. You could buy an external CD drive to plug into a USB port in your computer, but you know, not an ideal situation in that case. So now we need to open up Windows Media Player. To do this, open up the Cortana search, which is that little white circle on your toolbar in Windows. And then in the search area, type in Windows Media Player, and it should show up. As soon as Windows Media Player shows up, you can go ahead and click on it to launch the application. You can see that I've already opened up Windows Media Player, and it could take a little bit of time for your computer to actually read your music CD, so I'm gonna skip ahead. Now we need to click Rip CD, and that's gonna rip all of these music tracks onto our computer. Skip ahead a little bit because it does take some time for it to rip all of those to your music library. And once all of that music is now ripped onto your computer, it's gonna be in your music folder on your PC. And to access this, we need to open up the file explorer. So again, we're gonna go over to Cortana, that little white circle in the toolbar. And in the search area, we're gonna type in file explorer. And as soon as it shows up, you can go ahead and click on it to launch the file explorer application, which should look something like this. And under the PC area, you should be able to find a folder that's called music and we're going to click on that to open it and you can see now i have the cd that i just ripped onto my computer and all of those tracks in my music folder now the next thing we need to do is hook our phone up to our computer so that we can transfer all of these music tracks over to our phone to do this you take out your usb cord this is probably the usb cord that you use to charge your phone with and plug one end in to an open usb port on your pc and the other end is going to be plugged in to your phone and at this point we need to make sure that our phone and pc can talk to each other it might be okay for you right out of the gate as soon as you plug it in but if not i'm going to just quickly walk you through how to get your pc and phone to talk to each other so just to show you, over in our file explorer, click on the little option that is your phone. Mine's called GM1917, it's just a random name. Yours might be more recognizable. But it shows that this folder is empty when I open up my phone. That means my PC and phone aren't currently talking to each other. So I need to change a setting on my phone to be able to have this communication take place. So I'm on my phone screen right now, pulling down the top bar and clicking on the little gear to open up settings and then go down to where it says Bluetooth and device connection, and then click on where it says USB. And then currently it says no data transfer, which is why our computer and phone aren't talking to each other. So we need to select the file transfer option. And as soon as that is changed, I'm gonna go back over to my computer. And now we need to open up and just make sure that everything is good to go. So we're going to actually open up our phone in a new tab. You do that by right clicking on your phone and then clicking open up a new tab. And now you can see that there's the internal storage that I can access because my phone and computer are now able to communicate with each other. Find the music folder that's in your phone and then go ahead and just drag and drop the CD that you ripped onto your computer over into that folder that says music that's in your phone's internal storage. And at this point, the CD is now onto our phone. So now going back over to my phone, you just need to launch whatever music application that you have. Mine's called Music Olet, and I got it from the Google Play Store. You might already have some music application built into your phone that you are currently using, but you just launch that and it should be able to find the CD that you loaded up. You can see here, this is that CD that I ripped onto my computer, transferred it over to my phone, and now the entire CD is here in my phone when I opened up the music application and it's ready to go to be listened to. So you can see it's a quite a number of steps to finish off this process, but if you walk through this step by step, you should find success. So thanks guys for stopping by. Consider subscribing for more and I hope to see you guys back here for future videos.